Hi everyone, welcome back to Stephen Kilagi's YouTube page. I'm here with the international businessman, Mr. Kim Zach Thomas. Um, Hello. <laughs> from APGL. Um, his company predominantly does shipping throughout South Africa, China, mining supplies, uh, mining supplies and stuff like that. Uh, what we wanted to talk to you about is uh, we're actually going to a meeting right now. Um, but before the meeting, we just wanted to ask a few questions to Kim and his company. What was the... When did you start? And uh, what was your motivation into starting your own company? And now you drive a, 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 like, a top of the range, range Rover. Well, I didn't have any money. Uh, I worked in an office. Um, I used to drink and party too much. It wasn't really going anywhere in life. And I just... I had, I had enough. So I started the company in a one-bedroom apartment, um, you know, with a one computer. My uh, printer was on a cardboard box, um, but I just I worked like 16-hour days uh, straight, and um, to try and get to where I am today, I'm not I'm not the as successful as I want to be because I'm always hungry for more. Did, so that's did, did you? Like, uh, did your parents or anyone help you out? Like, gave you like a million bucks or stuff? <laughs> well, my father died when I was quite young, and uh, my mother um, lives in another state. Um, and you know, I don't come from a family of money, so I started with 50 bucks in my pocket and just uh, worked my contacts, worked as much people as possible, um, and just learned as I went. I didn't know a lot as well, but I learned as I, as I went. and. You know, we have a multinational company now where we have offices in four different countries. Kim, I think we both come from similar background. Um, my father died when I was about nine to ten. And do you think people who come from backgrounds like us, from a hard life, from a hard childhood, we are more, we're tougher and we, we're more hungrier. We're the, like The Rock says, Dwayne Johnson. It's going to be the hardest work in the room. Yeah. Um, does that motivate you when you see like rich kids who get everything, and they're not as hungry as you? Rich kids who get everything don't come across on my radar. They don't mean anything to me because rich kids. It doesn't mean it matter how much you can have money. There's a lot of people who don't have money who are still lazy uh, because they don't have the motivation. Um, it's up to you know. It's up to the individual. Um, if you if you really want something in life, only you can change it. So the best thing is to do, if you're not happy, change it. Only you can make a difference. Yeah, that's it. So there you go. It doesn't matter what, uh, where you come in life. You can, you can be born into a wealthy family. Um, not all spoiled kids are, I mean, from wealthy families do make it because their parents basically spoil them and they don't work for it. But most people who don't come from well-off families, we want it. It's kind of embedded in your life, and you just want to change your life. And that's why Kim and myself we're pretty similar. Where uh, uh, we're missing our father figure when we we're small, uh, grow up with a single mom. But as we're growing up, we knew that no one's gonna, no one's gonna throw a life vest away. You just have to make your own life vest. It's either swim or sink sink or swim so that's what life is about uh, busting your ass working hard and look uh, whatever you want you can get it just just work hard enough so I hope hopefully you like this message thank you Kim for sharing your your, your, your story with us um, and I love your car by the way it's, it's a top of the range uh, over Finch uh, Range Rover I found it. and it's um, it's one of the top it's pretty good leather interior and that's what it is, like uh, what life is. You you work hard and you spoil yourself with uh, the best in life. So anyway, if you like this um, motivational clip, uh, if you're in Papua New Guinea or Pacific, anything is possible. Just believe in yourself. You can do it. Uh, my brother Kim did it. I did it. You can do it too. If you like it, like, subscribe. Please comment below. I, I really enjoy reading your comments and your whatever how uh, those clips motivated you. And stay motivated and stay pumped up. See ya.